looking forward to kicking those guys in the teeth. Get us there, and we'll save you a place in line. Did I hear right? You're going after the Archon's ship? Looks like it. Last time we crossed his path, you nearly broke my baby here. Now tell me you have a better plan of escape this go around. We'll be winging it, as usual. <sighs> I'll get my tools. Just... stay out of the skirt, huh? Regale me with some poker wisdom. <laughs> well, bluffing and reading players aside, poker is all about math. If the odds of getting the card you need are greater than the bet, make the bet. How's your friend Jill doing? Good. Busy. Apparently, prepping multiple species for procreation is a lot of work. Who knew? Waiting to get it all started was killing her. Now she's being shot out of a cannon, so to speak. Out with it already. What's the deal with you and Callo? Anything I should be concerned about? Ah, uh, twist my arm, why don't you? It, it's contrasting styles more than anything. He's a blueprint guy. I'm gears and guts. Got ink on his digits, not grease, up to his elbows. If you didn't have me to balance him out, you might be in trouble. <sighs> Heck, maybe that goes both ways. Good talking to you, Gil. Anytime. Got any stories or advice to share? Does a pie jack scratch its butt? Tell me more about fighting Ket. So, Chosen, it's not good to let too many of them get close to you at once. If they hit your shields, take a step back. Let me handle them. Bet you anything they're not used to being rushed by a Krogan. We can talk more later. Sure. Ah, oh, Ryder. Sorry for the mess. Who's your friend? An exalted cat. I called Jarl to show him. Ah, oh, there he is. Jarl, look at this. There's nothing Angara inside. The physical can be deceiving. I've run hundreds of tests. Only traces of the Angara genome remain. The exalted are cat. There must be a way to fix them. Anything's possible. We just have to keep trying. Even from mistakes, we can learn. Thank you, Ryder. What? Jarl needs to accept that exaltation is permanent. You're making his grief worse. I didn't think about it like that. Because you see him as a friend, not a patient. That's why I'm here. To observe and treat. Jarl is part of this crew. His welfare is my responsibility. I know this job was a surprise, but you've really stepped up. And look, you got your cat sample. Their bodies are unlike anything I've seen. Centuries of gene stealing, crafted evolution. It's horrible, of course, but also fascinating. Glad you're settling in. Sink or swim, right? I should probably clean this up before it starts to smell. Just waiting on that armor requisition slash project. No pressure. 
We'll talk later. I know it. You always look hungry. He's a good boy, aren't you? Aren't you? You do know Pyjack's pee anywhere, right? Hello, Sarah. How are those jokes coming, Sam? Why do Elcor start stampedes? Because they wish to be heard. Uh... Thanks, Sam. Nothing more. Managed to save the Moshai. I only wish we could have saved more. Oh, come on, think. Think! I need something. Who are you talking to? Ryder! Shit! You shouldn't sneak up on someone like that. I'm just talking to myself. Don't tell me you never do that. You seem stressed. No kidding. I'm not built for this kind of homesteading. I don't like people knowing where I am, where my stuff is. Ugh! You've got to relax. You're starting to stress me out. I'd like to. I need to. Yes. When I felt like this back home, I'd look for a zero-G chamber, or at least an isolation tank. Some place to just drift away. I could really use that now. If I may, gravity can be overridden in the escape pod. You can create a zero-G chamber. Of course! Sam, you're a genius. It's easy. It'll make a huge difference, Ryder. You'll see. You know, there's room for two. You're willing to share? I won't cramp your style. Let's find out. All right, I'm in. And this should do it. <sighs> Close your eyes. Relax. <laughs> Let yourself go. Mm. Oh, this hits the spot. Ryder? Yeah? There's something else that would relax me. What's that? You haven't taken the bait yet, but I'm not afraid of rejection. Wanna fool around? <laughs> Doesn't matter if you have something else going on. I can be utterly discreet. Just fun. Two people blowing off steam. No strings attached. Only 
if there's no strings. I don't think so, PB. That's fine. Say no more. PB, listen. Hey, don't you know what say no more means? Really, I mean it. No explanation necessary. Just thank you for this. The hell you did? You can't just undo ten hours of work. I had to. Your revamp risks power imbalance between decks. Something we solved back home. It's twice as efficient. Just because it doesn't match your sainted specs. And now it does. As you say, deal with it. Callo. I know, just... Please don't let this distract you. The discovery of Aya was just what we needed, Ryder. The Angaran scientists have been so generous in sharing their wisdom. It's been amazing. Angaran expertise will be a tremendous help to the initiative. We were certainly hurting for it. I'm thankful the Angara were willing to risk working with us. I'm afraid not all of them are quite so friendly. Some give trust easily. From others, you have to earn it. I'm confident we'll get there. I should get back to things. Sounds good. I'm picking up something. Probes launched. I found something. According to that astronomer on Aya, a satellite should be here. I'm not detecting anything. If it was here, it's gone. You mean destroyed? I mean, gone. Destruction would leave debris. We've got nothing. Let's try another nav point.
tried. Free for an interview? I'd like to know more about the Angara. It's not often a first contact goes so smoothly. At least the Angara are more peaceful than the Ket. There's high hopes for this alliance. The Angara are survivors, and they're willing to help. They'll be great allies. The Angara soldier who joined your team has a few fans already, but everyone's talking about Aya. Green plants, flowing water? Our leaders have discussed whether we should send colonists there. If the Angara say yes, I don't see why not. I wonder who gets to make that call. The Angara don't have much of a government left. Okay, that's... Colonist registration is up since last episode, as is morale. Tan sent this for you. Inspiring, huh? What are you doing with that ship? That part doesn't go there. I gotta tell Cash to do something about her mechanics. I wonder what my dad would think of all this. Would he have encouraged the move? Come with us if he could? Does dwelling on what-ifs help anything? Things are the way they are. I can't just forget my father. Sid doesn't remember anything about him, but I do. I think he might have liked it here.